Hey, welcome to the video guys. This is Bigfoot and I'm the best copper four in the world. So if you think you're a really good Rainbow Six player, you've seen nothing yet because you're about to see some amazing copper level gameplay. Thank you for watching. We're going to start this video off right. I'm going to miss the window because why not? I mean, oh, okay, I'll just fall off the building too. Um, you know, I always felt more comfortable with 50 health anyway. instead of 100, so I called my friend over to come and revive me. It's always good to have teammates on your side. You know, usually I try to surround myself with like-minded individuals, so obviously I would prefer to be friends with copper players, but this guy I think is a silver, like the low end of silver. So, I mean, what can you do? He revived me, so that's about all you can ask for. Looks like a teammate got a kill. Maybe that will help me get to Copper 3. Let's see. And, uh, oh, there goes my friend. He falls off the building. So, I was thinking earlier that he wasn't really on my level. But now that I've seen his gameplay, honestly, I think he's a Copper 4 at heart. So, I'm going to go back down here. I'm going to revive him. It's only fair he revived me. And with that... We're both at 50 health, we're both copper fours at heart, and let's go, let's get this win. Alright, that EMP did a lot of good, and uh, yeah, let's shoot, shoot at the wall. Okay, there's an enemy there, we shot him a little bit. All right, let's chase him down. I feel like that's the right thing to do, especially as a copper four. I would know. Uh, there's two down there. Let's shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Okay, we got one. Luckily, my aim was good enough that I have to reload. Uh, you know, that always helps. And I see an enemy outside. I'm shooting him up. Um, I appreciate the attempt to be as good as a copper four, but it didn't really work out in his favor. Please notice at this point my friend actually fell off the roof. Uh, I got the headshot, so that's cool. Let's see if I can jump into the objective and finish this round off the right. It's a 1v1 situation. He's downstairs, I'm upstairs, and he's dead, and I won the round. When you're Copper 4, there's only two things you really have to worry about. Because those are the only things that are really on your level and that are powerful enough to kill you. One of those is Fuse. He just took out two of my teammates, so I have to be on high alert. If Fuse uses his balls anywhere near me, I will most likely die because I am only a Copper 4. Luckily, sometimes Copper 4s can hit headshots, so that's cool. Um, let's see if I can hit another one, and that uh, yeah, wasn't a headshot, but it's close enough. We'll call it a headshot. We've got a spot down the hallway, and if I wasn't a Copper 4, I'm going to actually run out there. But instead, I'm going to shoot this guy's feet in true Copper 4 fashion. Uh, am I saying Copper 4 too much? Who knows? Probably, but I don't care. I'm a Copper 4, and everyone knows it. So the, the Castle Barricade is really doing me a lot of good. I've got one teammate. He's not a castle. Um, but, you know, whatever. The enemy got through the castle eventually. And I'm hopefully going to be able to defend this objective because that's really a Copper Four's main objective, is to defend the objective. There's his gun. Um, it's a patience game at this point, but you could also just blow him up. Remaining. So that's cool. It's a 2v1. Um, the odds are finally in our favor. You know, this is uh, a perfect situation. And let's see what happens next. This is a pretty high level kill cam. There's no way he's any less than a Copper One. 